grab that peritoneal lining from inside that gut cavity and then find a spot for your knife and carefully work it along those bones. And now for my super secret, heirloom tomatoes from the garden. Ho oh, ho, oh, heaven. This is a Greek stuffed lobster with uh, tomato sauce and uh, feta cheese and some basil. So um, I suggest you guys give it a try. I've already tried some of the lobster and the tomato sauce. It's outstanding. You gotta take your time and split this sucker right in the middle. Otherwise, you're gonna have a feud. Someone's gonna get a bigger piece than another person. Everything's ready to go. The only thing left here is some seasoning, some salt, pepper, some lemon, some olive oil, and pop them on the grill. Hey, is there some reason you need to be like 10 feet away from me, Ross? See all these boats are spread out. A more courteous, courteous if you like spread yourself a little from other boats. Hey, you know, I appreciate you letting me know that. And unfortunately, I don't have an anchor, so I'm drifting, but I'll keep away from you, buddy. I'm sitting right on that spot that that boater was sitting on. They gave me a hard time. I used my uh, my chart mapping and I figured out where he was sitting and I sat right there. There we go. First thing I want to do is I want to scrub the skin. I use a, uh, a very stiff nylon brush. Single long strokes rather than small hacking strokes. That way I'll keep nice clean cuts on the fillets. I'm on. Yeah, I'm on. Holy moly. Oh, we got two. <laughs> You're good. <laughs> Sweet, dude. Oh, man, we're eating good tonight.